Hello everyone and welcome. This is being live streamed on twitch.tv and hopefully will be uploaded to YouTube at a later date. This is my first playthrough of Resident Evil Village. I've already configured the game, so it should be ready to go. I'll just play through on standard difficulty. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. The bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as a wild wind rose around the beasts. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark, yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. A local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. Okay. Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. <laughs> yeah, the way he said that. When you talk about putting your dog down, it doesn't mean the same thing as putting him to bed. Oh, no narration? So will I get to look at stuff after I put the baby in bed? Oh my, there's a whole house to look at.
I assume some sort of children's programming. A fairly nice house. Looks pretty old, too. Very generic photos on the wall, though. I don't even know what the hell that is supposed to be a photo of. I mean, it could be water, but I think it's upside down if it's water. I swear, those are the highest quality pickles I've ever seen in a video game. It's sad that they covered up all this detail under so much blur. Mom got you another new book? <laughs> Once you're a big girl, we'll have a drink together, all right? That's quite a few years from now. I mean, unless you're in Europe. Oh, Mia. What a miracle. Yeah, it's surprising that either of you made it out of that debacle. Hurry up and put Rose to sleep, will you? Our taste in music's definitely improved over the years. You mean mine has. Okay, so it has a little caption if you press the button again. I just assumed it played the same sound clip over and over each time you clicked it. You hungry? No? Maybe later then. She looks like she's asleep. Why would she be hungry? I mean, unless you didn't feed her. Does this an office? You don't get your water out of the tap? I guess some people do have those in their homes. Wait, that had a note to Ethan. Don't give her any sugar or honey and no mushrooms. Really? Her birthday will be here before we know it. They grow up fast. Let's just enjoy it while we can. Do you guys have a ton of food sitting out? It looks like she's cooking dinner. There's dinner sitting on the table. Okay, that goes to the stairwell. This looks like a pantry. It's kind of hard to look at the shelving. Half whole flour. Mia makes everything by hand, so this stuff keeps piling up. <laughs> Wait, what does that say? Oh, horn of plenty. Jugs of alcohol. So where on earth do they live now? Got photos from Africa. Photos from some tropical island. Stock photography. Yeah, really generic photos. What on earth is that? What on earth? There's some goop in the middle of that painting. Well, upper right of the middle. Strange. It's difficult to look around with the kid in his arms. She's going to grow up beautiful. I assume that's a 3D render of the kid.
Once things warm up, we can go for a walk. What is it, winter right now? I don't know, would that be ironic, ironic since I think his name is Winters? There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. <laughs> to be fair, at her age, she wouldn't comprehend what's being said. Your mama and I love this song so much. What song was it? I couldn't even hear it. Um, automatic doors? Do they also have automatic toilets? It's amazing how much texture Almost detail there, there is honey. with the correct sharpening filters. Or is this her room? Maybe we should look at the other rooms first. Just in case we meet, we go into a cutscene or something. It's a little dark over here. What a bobblehead. I even keep this around. I should get rid of it someday. Is it the bobbleheads I was shooting in the last game? Were there bobbleheads in the last game? I no longer remember. I vaguely remember the last game, but I don't remember much in the way of details. Do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. This room is very dirty, especially some of this furniture. Eastern European castles and keeps. So we're in Eastern Europe somewhere. So in order to escape their fears, they moved across an ocean. Seems a little strange. Maybe they were trying to escape more than their fears. Horn of Plenty. Toxic gas leaks in Louisiana in 2017. Hmm. So the incident in the previous game was blamed on toxic gas leaks. Yep. Apparently Ethan and his wife are uh, MIA. Ten years before the area is it habitable again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Well, I guess there's nothing else to see, except the baby's room. We can't run when we're holding the baby, but I guess that makes sense. Don't imagine the baby would stay asleep if you're running around jostling it all over the place. Oh, that's a photo of, okay, a couple of kids. I was trying to figure out what I was looking at. This plant doesn't look too terribly great. Wow, biggest room in the house. Wait, where did Ethan and Mia sleep? Oh, this is their room. And the crib is just in it. Okay. Well, I mean, that makes sense. Okay. So we're at the point where it's just captions for stuff. Did I look at the other side of the bed? Now, considering what he's been through, I could imagine he'd be 
terrified every time he opened a door, you know? Can I kick that? Yes, I can. What's that noise? Oh. I didn't realize that those moved. Apparently she doesn't like this room. Scrapbook, I guess. Like photo album, scrapbook, whatever. I wish it could stay like this forever. <laughs> Nothing ever stays the same, Ethan. Manual we to get you. Time for bed. <laughs> well, hi there, little Rose. <laughs> that looks like a fairly old stereo, except for the digital display. I think it's just designed to look old. BSAA. Did the BSAA put them up here? Rose is fine. What is this? Is it a case of some sort or electronic device? But it's got a power button. It must be electronic device of some sort. I have no clue. This is a turntable. You don't see those very often these days. This is a very rugged looking laptop. <laughs> so apparently she still gets mad at him if he mentions what happened in the previous game. Okay, they are saying they're in Europe, but so far not where in Europe. Okay, just a little bit of plot, I guess. Nothing important. Can't keep your mother waiting. She's scary when she's angry. <laughs> yeah. She also cut your hand off, didn't she? There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. <laughs> Well, you now. What was that, a baby monitor? <laughs> Probably. I've already looked at that. Okay, so I could have looked at everything after putting her in the crib. That's fine. So there are only two bedrooms in this house? You know, as large as it is, I expected more than two. Also, there's a master bedroom, but I didn't see a master bathroom. Of course, this is Europe, so maybe that's normal. Have you finished putting her to bed yet? Is she in the bathroom now? Yeah, there's a study, which interestingly enough, you have to go through the bedroom to get to. Although it's not the only house I've seen that's like that. Is she in here? No, must have been coming up the stairs. Don't they have lights on one side of the room? Strange. I didn't look at the door. Keep it down. Just making sure it's locked. Here's the cutscene I was expecting. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Mm, 
That smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de legume. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Hmm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. <sighs> you really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <sighs> Mia, get down. Why are they still shooting her? I think they're just shooting the crap out of the house in general. She was in the wrong place at the wrong time. Mia. Oh, God. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! That's not Chris. What? What? So what the hell is that pistol? Go on, move! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Rose. Get him out of here. I don't think they animated the baby very well. Hey doc. hey, doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next phase before clock? No problem. We'll be there. We'll be there. That was the that doc. Was doc. She'll see us see next, week. next week. Hey, now. Think positively, Think positively all, right? all right? We talked we about, this. about this. I know. I know. We hardly we talk about anything about else. else. Keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just won't. Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. That phone interrupts a lot, doesn't it? They throw him out with the trash. Is he in the snow? It doesn't look like snow. It doesn't act like snow. Jesus. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off the Fuck. <laughs> Looks like they got hit. What the hell happened here? I don't want to search for weapons, Ethan. Okay, I have control, so I'm going to search for weapons. Eliminate target, recover body, secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Hmm. Move the two. 
Winters's to Site C for further investigation. That just looks weird. At least two transport officers to accompany them. Of course, it's useless. It's called plot. Can I not get around this guy? Guns. Guns. Can I get in the vehicle? No, okay, there's a collision mesh there. More than likely. Do they actually call it collision mesh these days? Or in this engine? I wasn't certain if the sound was actually synchronized properly with the uh, blinking of the light. Interesting. I'm sure Chris survived. Not that it sounded like Chris or even really looked like Chris. But I'm sure he survived. Granted, Chris is a lot older, and people do tend to look different when they're older. <laughs> yeah, be careful with that. But we can't stand up yet. Kind of a crappy flashlight. Rock slide in the snow. Someone kill a bird here. You know, the graphics in this game are infinitely better than Resident Evil 7. Speaking of a bird. They're actually trying to make this scary. Holy cow, that's a lot of birds. That's a lot more birds. That bird's not dead. <laughs> it looks kind of silly clipping through everything now. That sound it does not sound like a bird. Oh, was that Chris? He can't really run, but I doubt Ethan is dressed for this. So he's probably freezing. Oh, someone killed all the fish, too. Can't see anything in there. A chain and icicles and a broom and a rope. Terrible flashlight. One of the broom. Oh yeah, that's it. You can just leave that door open. Let yourself freeze to death. Someone's purse. Well, you know someone's probably here or in the vicinity. I mean, how many women leave without their purse? Unless it's just a spare. Nothing of use in there. Oh, potatoes. At least I think those are potatoes. Oh, they look kind of rotten, though. Oh, I think whoever lived here hasn't been here in a while. Oh, okay. It was just stopping the dripping. 
does the flashlight aim down? Ethan, do you not know how to hold a flashlight? Pills. Nasal spray. Something else. A lot of potatoes. Nasty looking potatoes. Hmm. Hello? Is there someone else in here? I should probably look up, shouldn't I? Oh, this bottle fell. Can I open this? This is where something happens, isn't it? Or not. <laughs> Terrible flashlight. Why is it pointed at the ground? Who points a flashlight at the ground when they're trying to see in front of them? goes down? Are those stuffed? I mean, that is. Judging from the fact that this is here, I'm going to assume those are stuffed as well. Can we take this with us? It's brighter than the flashlight is. <laughs> it's bringing back some bad memories, Ethan. Oh, garlic, I think. I think that's what that is. Someone hang that in here to ward off the vampires? There's a lot of it. 